Oh my god, girl. Did you see what Bridget wore yesterday? That was so ugly. I know. It was it was hideous. I couldn't believe it. Did you see Jeff? Amy, you gotta do your so calculus dream. homework. Every uh, 12 o'clock, Amy does a calculus homework. You gotta go home. Gosh, Amy, your dad is so uncool. I'm sorry, Sarah. Okay, Amy. Do your calculus homework. I don't get it, though. It's so easy. You just gotta take the antiderivative and take the integral. And you get b squared minus 4ac. Hello, is this Mr. Tan? So take the antiderivative of uh, x squared from 0 to uh, 54 and add another antiderivative to e to the natural log. Oh, I got a phone call. Annyeong. Oh, it's a stockbroker. Talk. This is Mr. Tan. He sent me no check. Um, yes, I'm losing money. Concerned, I didn't get a check that I expected two weeks ago. I'm terribly sorry for that discrepancy, sir. Why are he cheating me? We go to New York. We go to New York and talk to him. If I don't receive any updates, I'm gonna come to New York to talk to your manager. Right now, we go to New York? No, 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 that won't be necessary. You don't need to speak to my manager. I promise I'll get the check sent to you as soon as possible. Okay, bye. So what we do now? Um, go to New York. Okay, we go to New York right now. So, what can I do for you, Mr. Tan? I need my check now. Oh, I'm terribly sorry I never got it to you. I think I have it right here. Here's your check. Uh, this is hundred dollars! I had thousand dollars! Mr. Tan, your English sounded impeccable on the phone. What what happened? Uh I leave now. I'm sorry. So seven plus four is ten. That's the answer. No, it's not. It's eleven. No, it's ten. Oh. Oh, it is eleven. Oh, my head hurts every 2 o'clock. Oh, I need to go to the hospital. Are you okay? No, I need to go to the hospital. Hello, doctor. Oh, hello, Mr. Tana. How are you today? Oh, my head's hurting. Oh uh, yeah, uh, yeah. We we had your CAT scan that we took last week, but uh, I, I kind of lost it. I th yeah. Lose my CAT scan, my paper? Uh, yeah, you'll be fine. It's it's whatever. You'll. How you lose my paper? It's just my it's CAT fine. scan. It's fine. It's just a benign tumor. Go home, sleep it off. You'll be fine. Benign tumor? It's fine. Just. Sleep I'm gonna it. die. No, sleep it off. You'll be fine. It's okay. It's nothing. No, big. I need my CAT scan. You'll be fine. You need to talk to my doctor. Why? My doc my doctor is good. Okay. Um, guess I'll give her a call. Hello? Hi, yeah, um your father uh, has has a, has a small benign tumor, um, but uh, I'm sorry that I uh, misplaced his CAT scan, but I, I assure you that I will find it as soon as possible. What do you mean you lost his CAT scan? Is he going to be okay? Yeah, uh, I'm sorry for, for all the things that you guys have gone through. Yeah, um, I, I assure you I'll find it. Okay, thank you, bye. Okay, alright, bye. Okay, what I just. What about to say? Okay, you. Uh, I'll find it. Uh, I'll give you a call back. Thank you. Thank you for coming and have a good day. And you'll be oh, fine. You'll be I fine. hate you. You'll be fine. To me, my father's English is perfectly clear, perfectly natural. It's my father tongue. His language, as I hear it, is vivid, direct, full of observation and imagery. That was the language that helped shape the way I saw things, expressed things, made sense of the world. Did you like my book? Yes, it's so easy to read.